Fatality. The fear of spiders is one of the most common fears that we humans have. Nearly one in three humans have an intense fear of spiders, and about two in three American homes probably have a spider inside of them at any given moment. That being said, as scary as spiders can be due to their creepy appearance, the strange movements that they make, as well as their behavior, spiders might actually be quite beneficial to us humans. If you can look past your fear just a little bit and look at what they actually do for us humans, you may begin to develop an appreciation for these interesting little creatures. In today's bit of content, we're going to be sharing with you some of the ways that spiders actually assist us humans and why maybe you should reconsider squashing that next spider inside of your bathroom or basement. The biggest way that spiders help us is via pest control. Spiders typically hunt pests such as mosquitoes and cockroaches, which would otherwise be infesting our homes. And mosquitoes and related pests such as cockroaches can be a huge problem when they get inside of your home. They like to suck your blood and attack you, which can be painful, but they can also spread diseases and also cause minor damage to your home. In the example of malaria, malaria alone kills 1 million people at least every single year. And that's just one disease, just transmitted by one creature, which is the mosquito. There are tens or perhaps even hundreds of millions of malaria cases every single year. And again, that's just one disease out of many which are transmitted by these little pests such as mosquitoes and cockroaches and other related insects. Spiders actually hunt these creatures. So while it's great that you're probably not going to be getting bit by a mosquito if a spider is hunting it, what's even better is you're at a reduced risk of getting some kind of deadly disease like malaria. Now if you have a garden outside of your home, there's also some good news for you. These creatures such as mosquitoes and cockroaches, as well as other insects which spiders hunt, can damage the garden. These creatures like to occasionally, not just mosquitoes, but some of the other creatures that spiders eat, they will mess up the garden. They will contaminate it and eat the vegetables that are growing inside of the garden and just make it not good. Well, spiders will actually hunt these creatures making it actually beneficial to have spiders in the garden. To make matters even better, spiders are typically not a threat to us humans. They typically only attack defensively. It's very rare to ever hear of some spider attack in which the spider was offensively attacking the human. They know that they are much smaller and weaker than us humans and that we can kill them just with a quick little one second squash. For that reason, they're not going to try to attack us. And to make things even better, spiders don't eat our blood. Unlike mosquitoes, which are willing to brave getting squashed for a little taste of human blood, spiders don't even eat our blood. So for that reason, they typically just prefer to avoid us and hunt other creatures. To make matters even better, spider populations are kept in check by themselves. If two spiders come across each other, there's a high chance that they would attack each other and actually fight for dominance. Whoever ends up winning the fight is going to kill the other spider and actually eat the smaller spider. This could be why in your basement you can see those really big long-legged spiders, but you're not going to see several smaller spiders. The reason for this is because that big long-legged spider, which is the most powerful, is actually hunting and eating the other spiders. Now all that being said, we do understand that spiders can be quite creepy and make you a little bit uncomfortable. That being said, there is a certain appreciation to be had for these little creatures given that they're doing so much to actually help us. Again, the way that they actually help us is by killing pests which would otherwise transmit deadly diseases to us. This doesn't necessarily mean that you should have a pet spider in the basement, ideally you would have no pests at all whatsoever. But next time you see a spider out in nature, know that they're doing a little bit good for us as they hunt millions upon millions, perhaps even billions of insects which would otherwise be transmitting deadly diseases to innocent humans. So if you think that you have a wildlife or pest related problem inside of your home, give us a call at 855-WILDLIFE or visit our website at wildlifexteam.com. 
Well, Wildlife X Team International specialize in safe and responsible removal of wildlife and pests. And when we can, we safely restore them to the wild and also restore any damage that they may have caused to your home as well as prevent the issue from happening again. Thank you so much and we'll see you later. Having trouble with wildlife in your home or office? Wildlife X Team is your solution to get rid of the raccoons, bats, rats, and snakes. Having a professional team, we offer both residential and commercial animal removal methods by using innovative and integrated techniques. Our services include animal trapping, dead animal removal, nuisance wild animal control, and animal capture. What are you waiting for? To get 24-7 service, call us at 855-WILDLIFE for an affordable solution for your nuisance wildlife issues.